This is surveillance video showing dozens of teens and young adults rushing into a Vallejo 7-Eleven on Sunday. Police say the location, which now has plywood covering a busted out window, was ransacked and items were stolen by some of those who went inside. But this is only part of what happened. Police and witnesses say everything started during a sideshow at this intersection in front of the store. And a male that shot, you know, blue jeans, black cat, pulled a gun from his hoodie and started shooting in that direction. Witnesses who live in this nearby neighborhood say the sideshow was going on for some time. And someone in this truck then tried to drive through it. And at one point we saw a white truck drive into the sideshow. Um, and the, the, all the kids from the sideshow went and grabbed him out of the, the truck and started beating him up and destroying his vehicle. Video shows people jumping on top of the truck as the crowd went after the driver. A fight even broke out in the area. At least two people were injured, according to police. One of them struck by a bullet and one of them running into the 7-Eleven for help. Witnesses tell us the crowd chased after the man who ran into the store. As this happened, Witnesses tell us others set the man's truck on fire. All this before police even arrived. Neighbors are fearful and chose not to show their face when we spoke with them Monday. This woman says she called police and officers did not arrive for at least 40 minutes. I'm a homeowner here and I pay my taxes and to not get the help that I need is, is really disheartening because I, I grew up here in Vallejo and... My city's not coming through for me. But the talk between officers on the police scanner spoke of cars running red lights and at least one ambulance blocked in. No arrests have been made. Vallejo police tell us they did respond at one point, along with deputies from the Napa County Sheriff's Department and the Solano County Sheriff's Office. Some neighbors say that's not good enough. I would love for the city of Vallejo to just get their act together, especially concerning the police department. Vallejo police are urging anyone with information in this case to come forward. But at the same time, I've talked with numerous neighbors who tell me they have video of what happened, but no detectives have come by. In Vallejo, J.R. Stone, ABC 7 News.